welcome to another episode of To The Point Tutorials, a series that bypasses all the fluff and focuses on what you really want to know. Let's begin. Most faculty are currently using a bare bones approach to the tech used in order to record their online content. I've been asked questions on how to improve audio quality and the lighting being used. Well, there are loads of options to sort out these issues, but it all depends on each person's budget. If you want to get the full shebang, then I would recommend buying a reasonable condenser microphone, a microphone stand with a reflection filter, an audio interface, and a pop filter. The microphone will connect to the audio interface and you'll use the audio interface to control inputs, outputs, gain, etc. The reflection filter will help you get a good sounding voice in less than optimal rooms and the pop filter will help you avoid sibilance and plosives. Great! Now you will sound awesome! It's time to look the part! Avoid having your back facing the window, but by now I guess you already know that. You can buy a circular light in order to light up your face in a flattering way. This will certainly make a difference on your videos and Zoom meetings. There are several cheap options out there, but I will leave you with the one shown here. Right, let's say you don't care about any of it and you just want to sound decent. If you are one of those, then I can only recommend a USB microphone and a pop filter. So that's a wrap. See you in the next episode.